everyone, it's Amy and welcome back to my channel. Special welcome to those of you who are new. Hello! Before we jump into today's video, I just want to ask you guys really nicely if you wouldn't mind at the end of this video going over to my new vlog channel and checking that out. I will leave the link in the description box down below. It's just that I've had a lot of people recently DMing me and commenting on my videos asking for more travel vlogs. They are happening. I've uploaded a bunch of them. It's just that they're not on this main channel anymore. They're all going to be over on that new vlog channel. So go ahead and check that one out. But let's get into today's video. So as you guys know, if you've been here before, I am all about encouraging you guys to live your best life be as happy as you can be and follow your dreams wherever they may take you. But take it from me and my own personal experience, it is very difficult to live your best life when you don't love the person that you are and have confidence in yourself. After all, of everyone in this entire world, you are the person that you have to spend the most amount of time with. So you better learn to love that person because you're stuck with them. So with that said, and because summer is well and truly upon us, hopefully we are all having a super duper time out in the sunshine, we are going to be talking about how to feel confident in a bikini. Yeah, I completely understand that putting on a bikini and stepping out into the world in front of people with eyes who can see you is a terrifying thing to do. And don't let the fact that you see me twirling around my room wearing bikinis for try on hauls make you think that I don't understand that because I definitely do. So today we're going to be talking about some tips and tricks and things that you can do to change your own perspective on your bikini body because you do already have one not something you have to go out to the shop and buy like you got a body you got a bikini hallelujah bikini body so these tips are just designed to help you appreciate what you have a little bit more and help you to feel a little bit more confident when you are stepping out onto the beach because girl I know it's hard so tip number one for being bikini body confident is realizing that in real life nobody is perfect we live in a very strange world where you can open up your phone at any time day or night and see millions of pictures of women in bikinis looking perfect no stretch marks no cellulite no rolls no double chins no sunburn they just look like glistening goddesses on the beach but that is not real life Instagram, and I say this, I will say it again, Instagram is not real life. When you actually get out onto your holiday or onto the beach or wherever it is that you're going that you wanna rock a bikini, just take a look around at the people who are there with you because unless you are holidaying in the Love Island Villa, everybody's got a little bit of something. Everybody's got a little bit of fat, a little bit of bingo wings, a little bit of cellulite. Like, nobody is airbrushed in real life. There's no face tune for real life, y'all. And so when you get out there and you actually look at how real people look, not on a screen, but in real life, it's really reassuring to know that you're not the only one with imperfections. In fact, every single person on this planet, even Beyonce, I am willing to bet, has imperfections. That's life. The second step to feeling confident in a bikini is a big one, and it is finding a bikini that works for you. Every body is different, and that means what suits me and makes me feel comfortable might not suit you and make you feel comfortable, might not suit the next person and make them feel comfortable. And the only way you're gonna know for sure what works for you is to get out there and try some things on. You wanna find something that makes you look good, that makes you feel good, and that way you really can step out onto the beach and feel great about what you're wearing. I know it's not as simple as that. I know that shopping for bikinis is a hassle. Trust me, I have one boob that's like significantly bigger than the other so trying to find a bikini top that can contain the one and not let the other one spill out is a whole <sighs> trauma but my top tips for finding the perfect bikini are try and find one where you can buy the bottoms and the top separately like if you saw my Shein haul from last week those came as a pair and then you're really stuck for sizing like some people are bigger on top than they are on bottom and vice versa so if you can buy things separately then that really helps my next tip to help you feel confident on the beach is to wear a cover-up and by no means am i saying that you have to cover yourself up at the beach or you should feel like you should cover yourself up at the beach should feel like you should cover yourself up 
you know what I mean. But I just know for me that when I'm up and about walking around, just being in a bikini with nothing over it is a little bit too much for me. So I like to have a cover up that I can throw on, whether it's a kind of like kimono type situation, a sarong, anything like that that just gives me a little bit of coverage just makes me feel so much more confident. So again, get out there and choose something that works for you. My next tip for being bikini body confident is to use positive affirmations. So when I was younger and I was still stuck in this really toxic mindset about the way that my body looked, I had all of these photographs and quotes stuck on the inside of my wardrobe doors of like really skinny girls with like hot pants on and things that said like don't eat that biscuit and I was really trying to burn into my subconscious that like this is what we're working towards you don't look good enough as you are this picture right here of these girls like Dallas Cowboys cheerleaders that's what you're aspiring towards and it was such a toxic and hurtful thing to do to myself. I'm never gonna look like a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. For one, I can't dance. For two, I just love carbs too much. So think about, if you take that example, how having those negative affirmations in my life had such a big impact, and it did, and we could have a whole video about that in itself. Like, if that could produce such a big effect, then think about what having positive affirmations in your life could do. Like just having a little note to yourself on your mirror that says, hey girl, you look beautiful. Or waking up every day, brushing your teeth, and then smiling at yourself in the mirror and saying, you are amazing the way you are. Just constantly reminding yourself that you are enough. Remind yourself how much you are worth and how awesome you are. My last tip for bikini confidence is fake it till you make it. Look, I've sat here for maybe thousands of years at this point, feels like a long video, and I have tried to tell you guys all the ways that I use to make myself feel better in a bikini. But that doesn't mean that when I put on a bikini, I am genuinely thrilled. I still see those imperfections. I still hear those nagging doubts in my brain every day. I've come a long way, but I wouldn't say that I'm the pinnacle of body positivity. But what I can do is get out there and act like I am. If I just throw my shoulders back, think to myself like, strut like you're on toddlers and tiaras, confidence is the most attractive thing. And the more that you act confident and exude confidence, the more confident you will truly begin to feel. There we go, those are my top tips for feeling confident in a bikini. And like I said right at the beginning of this video, if you have a body and you have a bikini, you have a bikini body. There is no end goal of looking forward and being like, if I can just lose two more pounds, if I can just get the cellulite off my bum, like I will be, what? What will you be? What will you achieve? Just be happy with what you are right now. Don't let life pass you by waiting for some unrealistic version of yourself to suddenly appear. Like, it's just it's crazy. Why are we wasting our lives like this? I don't know. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Go ahead and let me know if you have any other video suggestions down below. What would help you live your best life? What kinds of videos can I make for you? Hope you all are having a super duper day. Have a great time on your holidays. Remember that you are amazing and beautiful and wonderful. Don't forget to go ahead and check out my vlog channel now that I'm done rambling over here. I'll link it down below. Go ahead, subscribe, do the things, Instagram, the bell, everything. And until next time, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.